are, are, are circle. Nobody knows you. You are nobody. You understand? And I wanted to change that because I was one of that person who, um, you know, I wasn't doing the things that I was doing. It is just a natural thing for me to, 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 to just give up myself to the point where even when I, I, I was diagnosed with cancer, I did my surgery and everything, like a doctor cut me off from participating and doing things. And I got so depressed. I got so depressed because what keep me going is the fact that I can do for others or I can give off myself to others for my community you understand and i wasn't able to do that so with all that even before the sickness so because of what i have observed in in the community i now think that something such as the international women achievers awards would um be a platform where it can um inspire enlightened uplift and empower so we created the international women achievers awards when i created the international women achievers awards the first show that i did i think it was like i don't know if it was oh my goodness i know it was under a hundred person that was there you understand so hear this so the International Women Achievers Awards, I'm going to read, I'm taking reading from my website. For those of you who really want to know what it is for, uh, why it is there, I want you to get on my website and you read um, why we are, why it is. Okay, Simone, good afternoon, good morning, I'm sorry. National Women Achievers Awards that can bring people together such as government body representative from the Prime Minister's office. Um, you, you, you know what I'm saying? These type of dignitaries, the police officers and, 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 and you name it. These people come to the International Women Achievers Awards. And it wasn't easy for me. It was not easy for me to bring it to where it is today. It was hard work. It was a lot of crying, still crying, fighting. International Women Achievers Awards, their times from, from the day it started, I have struggled. Who have, come, um, have created something when I started this, to create something that, 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 that would compete with what I'm doing. So I am now competing with others. Today, they, I don't see them. I don't hear of them. They are gone, but I am still standing here. 12 years. So when I'm, I go out or someone nominates somebody, I feel that you know, when I look at their bios and I see the work that they're doing, persons may think, okay, I don't, um, we're not checking these persons out. I want to be clear. Maybe that's something we should start doing too. I want to be clear that we are not, in, um, it's not about the personal, the, the person's personal, uh, like, when was the last time? Who are you with? Which man you did with? And you understand? It is not that. It is what you do in your communities, what you're doing for yourself. How did you achieve? How are you aspiring? How are you inspiring or enlightening or empowering someone else? That's what it's all about. So I am not going to go dig into someone's personal life understand and persons would say why is this there and why is that there no this is not what it's all about so, um no one two years ago no one two years ago knows what international even know about international women achieves award and if you did you never one day like you never one day share you never one year come or call and say princess how can i help princess you are doing a good thing for women what can i do to make a difference no 
and now since um since I have awarded unto Donna Donna everyone started a, a, a quite a few people now because of the follower that Donna has a quite a few people now starting to 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 to, to know or to see what international women achievers award is and that is the, that that is the, the, the purpose of it because we just don't want to sit here we this is an international thing we want the world to know about it we want to go from the east to the west the north and the south right so that's what it is all about so for those people who might be saying poppy show this and poppy show that poppy show what until you know and you experience and you come and see what it is all about don't 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 beat it down don't beat it down it is not fair you don't know from where it is coming you see a lot of people don't know the story they only see the glory and when you see a little door starting to open everyone wants to jump on the bandwagon and all for the wrong reasons let me tell you if you're coming on the bandwagon or if you're coming on the wagon of the international women achievers awards and you have the wrong motive or you have the wrong whatever get off because you're gonna fall off and you're gonna hurt yourself now, um, there, there, there are some things that I said that I wouldn't address and I wouldn't even bother talk, uh, talking about it. And when I look and see how hard I have worked to bring this thing to where it is today, and, and I feel upon myself that I should honor a woman because of what they are doing in their community and when i see i i, I go out it's a hundred dollars per trophy you know to purchase them trophies taxes and whatever i don't care who want to say it was purchased as amazon you have to purchase it someplace right and it's not easy money to honor 23 women sometimes 24 19 at times each year and for someone because they do not like or something did not go their way they would want to destroy it that's an insult i wasn't going to talk about it because i the first thing i said if anyone who who have, have received an award from the international women achievers awards take upon themselves to destroy that trophy they know within their heart they were never ever deserving of it in the first place so that's that now we stand for dignity i've always said that when i look and see from where we women are coming and this is what each year we have a theme and the theme may be body um positive body image we um um stop the violence against women and young girls um you know different things this year we have dignity and justice and when i say dignity and justice i am looking at where women are coming from today women are being abused by men by their husbands as a woman disrespecting themselves disrespecting another woman it is so wrong it is so wrong and so because of that international women achievers award will not tolerate that we have zero tolerance for that i hear a woman says okay um a man is disrespecting me and 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 as a, a me princess as a woman who represents women and advocates for women should defend it what am I defending? Listen to me. If you as a woman can look up on another woman and go up under another woman and 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 this and 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 and, and, and bring down that woman and talk so disrespectfully about another woman, you are disrespecting yourself, you're disrespecting all women.
So when we do that, it is like you put a bullet into a gun and you shoot yourself or you shoot all the women. So when you do that as a woman, you're saying to, 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 to the men out there, it is okay because I'm doing it to me. So it is okay. So when they come now and disrespecting you, and in fact, what I'm talking about, that woman was not being disrespected, but then she was being corrected by a man who was disgusted with their behavior as a woman disrespecting other women. And here we are again today, day. Here we have another woman disrespecting another woman. Not only that, and I'm going to say it, Anna. I am, I, I, I am so disappointed. I am so disappointed with you. As a woman, as a wife, a mother, maybe you are a sister, maybe you are an aunt. And for you to go and do what you did, not only that this person is one of your biggest, biggest donor. But to, to, to disrespect her. And then you're going to say things like, oh, you give me this. For, uh, you know, if somebody give me something and, and I felt that they did not give it to me with a good heart. Trust and believe me, I'm returning it. But that's beside the point. The thing is that what you did, what you said was wrong on all level. And an and International Women Achievers Award will not tolerate that. We cannot condone it. And when I said that, because what am I saying? What message am I sending to other women, to the young girls? We see today in the schools where they are and in the streets, the young girls, the way they're carrying themselves, the way they're behaving. And if we as adults, as women, um, they, uh, they cannot look up to us, remember what I said. The International Women Achievers Award was created to inspire young women. You understand? And if we cannot do that, and, and, and what do we expect for them to do? How do we expect? We have nothing to say to them. And I'm so sorry I did send Anna a message and I come live with this because um, we, we publicly announce our, our, um, our recipients. We publicly, and, um, and um, what Anna did, she publicly did it. And so International Women Achievers Awards and me being the CEO of the International Women Achievers Award, I am coming publicly and I'm saying to you, Anna, that we have no choice and because of the zero tolerance that we have for the disrespecting of um, you not being able to inspire or to, or to empower, empower others, we have no choice but to disqualify you from the International Women Achievers Awards. And we cannot honor you with the bad behavior that you pursued. We cannot do that. And so I'm sorry, you have been removed from the International Women Achievers Awards as one to receive one of the biggest, um, the highest category um, humanitarian awards, okay? And so there you have it today. That is how what um, the um, we said, and that's what it's going to be. And I am done with that. But it's we will not toler toler we will not tolerate this. And a parasite come by, and you guys are talking. I hear I hear International Women Achievers Awards. Like we as black people. We instead we look and see what what this thing has done. It's said uh, twelve years. See what it has done in the lives of others. You choose to look at the negative, the negative that that that, that you can find. Why do we why do we do that? Why is it that one day some of us cannot just get up and see positive, even when others see the negative, you choose to see the positive in each other.